Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. This is my first YouTube video that I'm uploading, so I'm both nervous and excited. For my first video, my friend suggested I play one of my favorite games and followed it up with the suggestion for this game, Mist. So that is what I'm going to play today. Let me just start up a new game here so we can see the intro sequence. It's a little bit of an old game, if you couldn't tell. Can't remember when it was released, uh, but it doesn't stop it from being one of my favorite games of all times. It's a little bit, a little bit loud. Yeah, here we go, finally. Missed. The moment I fell into the fissures, that the book would not be destroyed as I had planned. It indeed falling into that starry expanse of which I had only a fleeting glimpse. I've tried to speculate where it might have landed. I must admit, however, such conjecture is futile. Still, questions about whose hands might one day hold my missed book are unsettling to me. I know my apprehensions might never be allayed. And so I close, realizing that perhaps the ending has not yet yet been written. written. All right, so not much of an intro. Let's click this book here. So this is a mist book, and in this game, why? In this game universe, there are different books around. Why? Okay. There are different books that have worlds inside of them. So we open this mist book here, and there's this little panel you can touch to go to the island of mist. And there are other books that have other panels where you can go to other worlds. So let's visit mist, see what awaits us. Oh, such good graphics. I love this game to bits. I have played it a couple of times, but can't remember anything, can't remember everything, so please forgive me if I make some silly mistakes or oversights. Let's do the best we can here. Alright, so that's big fat nothing. There is a panel here. Topographical extrusion, extrusion test, water turbulent pool, marker switch diagram, etc, etc. So there's numbers here we can input. Can't remember what they are, so we'll come back to this later. Um, the movement is just clicking, if you couldn't tell that, and so it might be a bit disorienting to get used to. I'll try and not go too quickly, which is what I usually do. Alright, little note on the ground here. Catherine, I've left for you a message of utmost importance in our fore chamber beside the dock. Enter the number of marker switches on this island into the imager to retrieve the message. Yours, Atris. So these are the switch markers. So this, we've clicked up on three of them so far. Um, there's not one in here, so I'll skip the inside of that for now. Four. I'm just going around getting these. Five. Six. And you will need to flip them up at some point. Um, seven over there. But not quite yet. Eight. Eight of them. All right. Let's see if that does the trick. Here we 
yeah, oops, come back here. Ugh. It's very picky about where you click it to move. Let's try. Eight? There we go. Catherine, my love, I have to leave quickly. Something terrible has happened. It's hard for me to believe. Most of my books have been destroyed. Catherine, it's one of our sons. I suspect Akinar, but I, I shouldn't leap to conclusions. I'll find him and Cirrus as well. Oh, I should have known better than to have left my library unchecked for so long. Well, I've removed the remaining undamaged books from the library and placed them in their places of protection. You shouldn't have to use the books until I return. But if you've forgotten the access keys, remember the tower rotation. Oh, and don't worry, Catherine. Everything will be fine. I'll see you shortly. Go oh, and erase this message after you viewed it, just to be safe. So... There's this message we found here from Atrus, and neither he nor Catherine are around. Uh, so something must have gone wrong, so we are here to find out just what that is. Alright, so first thing we'll do is come in here. There's a bunch more books in here. Some of them have stories. Lots of information. Uh, but most of them are burnt, as you heard Atris say. They've ruined... Someone has ruined his linking books. So, alright, let's look at this. So, one of the other goals of the game is to collect blue and red pages. And what you do with them is you put them into these blue and red books, respectively. So, let's see what happens when we do that. Let's we'll start with the red book, because it's here. That's, that's enough of that. He might say some more things, but it's all very cut out, insignificant at this point. The more pages you bring, the clearer they get. So let's listen to the blue book now. Here we go. Enough of him as well. It's, that noise is terrible. So, he seems a little bit crazy. But we'll find out more about that later. Alright, so first thing we're gonna do is try and get to a new world to find more clues. This is a map of the island here, and you can rotate this tower we're in by clicking and holding. And what we'll do is, this is the first one in line. See the line lit up red, so it's sending. I don't know if it's sending power or receiving a signal or what exactly it's doing, but it's in line there. So we'll come over here, click this painting. And that will lower this bookshelf so we can get into the secret chamber in the back. Oh, there are flies! Get out. summer and hot and there are just flies everywhere. I cannot get rid of them. Alright, so we're going up to the library. Alright, first thing we'll do is, oops, climb up here. Look out this window, so uh, I don't know if you remember, at the very beginning, you could see these giant gears. 
the very beginning when we were down at the docks. So that is where we're going first. So if we go around here, this is the key. And now we'll come up here. So this is your clue. 240, 2, 2, 1. And for mist, I usually have a little notebook so I can write down clues because there's a lot of puzzles that we'll be solving. But I, well, I have mine right over here. Forgot to bring it. There we go. Alright, so I just have a little notebook here that I'll be writing clues in. So, let's see. Alright. 240, 221. Okay. Now that we have that, I'll go back down. Flash not turned on. Options. Zip mode. Yes. So this is very convenient. What it will do is see now instead of my pointer, it has a little lightning bolt. So it just is like a fast travel so you don't have to click 50 million times to get to one place. So let's do that. Down in the bottom now. I'll travel back down this hallway. So you see the front door is shut now. So we have to touch this painting to open it. That will close the secret bookshelf door and open the front door. So let's go out, go down to this clock tower. So the time was, t see, clock, clock tower time, 2.40. So um, that changed the minute, so 5, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40. One, two. Excellent. We've got a little path in the water now. 240. All right. Throw that up. And then we'll go in here. And here is where we try and input two, two, one. I always have problems with this puzzle, so let's see how many goes it takes me to get it this time. Pull that down. Nope, back to where we started. Reset. Yes! Okay! Only took mm, half a dozen tries. Okay, so this is that gear that was out front and it's moved up, so let's go see what that is over here. There we, oop, uh, that lightning bolt pops up when you least expect it sometimes. So, as you can see, this has also turned over to reveal another book. And if we open this one, there is indeed a new world for us to go to. But we'll get to that next time. So thank you all for watching this video. I'll continue with it next time. And if you have any other games you'd like to watch me play or have any other ideas, please let me know. And I'll see you next time. Bye!